yo guys how's it going welcome to another video if you're new here be sure to hit that sub button we're doing a giveaway at 500 subscribers it's going to be dope and if you're already a sub be sure to hit that bell turn notifications on so you won't miss another amazing video without further ado let's get started so i'm here to introduce you guys to a new pack called the primival ford pack I definitely pronounced that wrong. It's like prime with Val at the end. It's like primival. I don't know if that's a real word, but like it's hard to it's hard to pronounce. This pack is all about going back in the times where the dinosaurs were. Uh, the armor is themed for bones and everything like that. Like it's going back back in like Azteca days, basically. I'll put a picture on the screen right now what the pack actually looks like. And I'll also tell you guys what the gear stats are and the gear that's in the pack. So this pack is pretty interesting. The first set of gear that we have is called the Fossil Avengers. Uh, we got the Fossil Avengers helmet, Skull Crusher, which is the one. We got the raiment, which is the armor or the chest plate or, or whatever and then we got the the stalkers which is the footwear or the, the boots i guess you could say the armor of the gear is pretty much universal it doesn't accompany any school uh it's 13 percent universal resistance plus 20 shadow pip rating some life uh power pip chance and some block uh what's most importantly special is the rest of the gear the one the boots and the helmet the hats and the boots give increased damage to fire death and balance and also gives crit rating to fire and universal crit rating which is pretty interesting you see gear give three different damage boosts to three different classes but for the crit it gives universal crit and a little bit more crit to fire so it's it's leaning more on the fire side of things but it also gives you a little bit of boost to other schools as well you can see the stats on the screen right now so i'm not going to explain everything just the things that poke out to me overall this gear doesn't seem to be all that great i still think dragoon gear is the best gear in the game if anything this gear gives a little bit more crit than dragoon gear but since we already have 100 percent crit all we're worried about is getting more damage so yeah this is the fire slash universal set slash death slash balance set i don't know it's, it's weird it's weird it looks cool but it's weird Next up, we have the Life Slash Storm set. This one's a little bit more normal as it specifically gives boost to Life and Storm. Just like the other set, it gives more crit than Dragoon, but the damage isn't there. And as I said before, since we already have 100% crit for the most part over Life, not life over fire and storm we're more worried about damage than anything but i mean the gear still looks pretty cool i don't think anyone's really going to use this gear for the stats maybe for the looks yeah i can see that happening but not really for the stats. and lastly we have the myth and ice set which is the same as the previous sets um the stats aren't all that great uh it's unique it's cool looking but i still think people are going to prefer dragoon gear over this not to say that i do want there to be armor in the game that everybody has to pay money to get and has better stats than dragoon but i mean i need a little bit of motivation to buy the packs you know overall when it comes to cosmetics i do think the gear is pretty cool looking especially the robe i can see me using that robe and stitching it with something else um i'm a fan of the wand as well i'm just not a fan of the whole the animation of holding it like a hammer i don't really I don't really like that, but I mean, the wand does look pretty cool. If they had made the wand like a sword, but like a dragon bone type sword, it would look awesome. Not really a fan of the hammer, but I mean, the wand does look pretty cool. I'm um, also, I really like the, uh, the armor, the armor, the chest piece. I, I like that a lot as well. Now, when it comes to the helmet and the boots, I feel like the helmet kind of gets in the way of your face like a lot. Like you can't really see your face other than your eyes. And that's really about it. I mean, it doesn't look bad, but I personally wouldn't use it in the boots. They don't look bad either. In the next video, we will be covering the Celestian Spellment Pack, which I am super, super hyped for. I'll leave a little spoiler on this video right here because the gear looks absolutely incredible. Without further ado, though, if you guys enjoyed, leave that like, comment, and subscription. Hopefully, you did enjoy. And if you didn't, then, you know, just leave me a comment down below. Tell me why you feel me. You know, we could talk it out, like, you know friends and stuff but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed uh have a great day and uh yeah peace